Hello and welcome to Biotechnica. I'm your host Shekhar Suman, CEO and Managing Director at Biotechnica and today I'm here to talk about a controversy which has erupted very recently and uh, I believe I should bring your attention towards it and that is about whether a PhD makes a good teacher or a net certification makes someone a good teacher. So this debate has been raging actually on Biotechnica website and I've been reading all your comments and I felt we should come together and do a video where uh, we can take this debate further. So uh, before we get started, I would request you to subscribe to our channel and do comment below what are your thoughts at the end of the video. So let's talk about the latest controversy, fair enough. What has happened is the national education policy is going to change the rule or maybe um, what has come up recently is PhDs don't need NET and the NET people who are qualified NET feel that NET must be there and uh, without that somebody should not become a teacher or assistant professor. So uh, what we did is at uh, Biotechnica, we compiled a small report, which uh, I'm going to show you uh, uh, shortly after a while, where we will show you the entire history of national education policy and how it has impacted uh, this particular domain and how good we are in producing teachers now. And at the end, I'll join you and uh, talk in a little bit, bit more detail about this controversy. Stay tuned. The committee, headed by Dr. K. Kasturi Rangan, has been tasked with drafting National Education Policy, NEP. The committee was recently presented with a request from many teachers who are also the members of the National Forum for Quality Education and All India, NET or SET Teachers, organization to make National Eligibility Test, NET, and State Eligibility Test, SET, as a recruitment exam. They have placed a demand that the PhD holders should not be given any exemption during the recruitment and they should be asked to clear the two entrances, taking you back to where it all began. In 1983, an 18-member committee, after a comprehensive survey and deliberations, had prescribed qualifying in NET as an essential condition for recruitment for the post of a lecturer in any university or a college throughout the country. This qualification was not to be relaxed even in the case of candidates possessing M, Phil and PhD at the time of recruitment. These recommendations were introduced in NEP or NEP 1986 after a discussion in the Parliament. Mungeka Committee, in its final report, removed the exemptions to M, Phil and PhD in the year 2007. In the year 2016, the compulsion of NET or SET saw a comeback after TSR Subramanian Committee presented the report on evolution of new education policy. According to this, there was an improvement in the quality of teachers joining higher education institutions as a result of NET. In 2018, UGC exempted PhD holders from appearing in NET or SET for their appointment as teachers even after facing many objections from the teacher communities. The teachers claimed that the new regulation was unfair to 8 lakh qualified candidates in India and will lead to the dilution of research standards. These developments have generated mixed reactions from the teaching community. Alright, so there you have it, you have seen the report, now you know what's, what is this controversy all about. So before I actually talk about this controversy, I would uh, tell you a small uh, quotation by Albert Einstein where he said, you have to learn the rules of the game and then play better than someone else. So. What, whatever happens at the end of this video or whatever you feel like, you have to understand this. First, you have to understand the rule and play it better than anyone, anyone else so, so that you have a you know, career as a teacher or a professor in this country. Now, teachers are the soul of this country. In fact, today I am able to speak and communicate with you and you are able to listen and understand only because at some point in time I had a great teacher and you had a great teacher. Am I right? Isn't it? So, if we need 
teachers or if India needs great teachers, what do we need? Do we need a PhD or do we need um, net qualification? What you think? I, I, I can tell you this, you must put in your comments in the comment section below because a lot of people are going to read it and that's how the policy is framed and it's very very important for you to express your views. views. Now let's come back to the topic. What makes a great teacher? What do you think? A three hours exam makes someone a great teacher or a six years of PhD makes someone a teacher while PhD is not a training of becoming a teacher. Right. What I personally feel is uh, we, we need a better policy making where we can have some more inclusions okay, of uh, teachers training. Okay. That can probably solve this problem, but maybe I can, I can be wrong, you say. But uh, I would leave it up to you to decide what's right. A PhD directly becoming a professor or a teacher or somebody must qualify the UGC net exam to become a teacher. What do you think? Do you think this is right or wrong? Whatever it is, please do like this video, subscribe to our channel and do let us know in comments what kind of videos you want us to make and we would love to make those videos so that the communication must go on so that we all grow intellectually and so that we all can support each other in this quest to make and build a better India for a better world. Thank you and have a great day ahead. Bye-bye.